What's up guys? So today you're gonna to watch a dude eating a pickle. Is that what you were looking for? Well, you found the right video. So I have a warhead pickle. It's not just any old pickle. Why would I just eat a pickle? Come on, it's gotta be special, right? Otherwise, why would you watch? Eh, some of you would still watch. You know you would. All right, so this is the Van Holten Sour Dill Pickle. Warheads, extreme sour. Shout out to my buddy, Corey. He's the one who showed me these existed. Corey loves the sour uh, pickles in general, loves sour stuff. Um, and I was at a five below and I saw it there, so I had to grab it. I'm sure they're available all over the place, but you know, if you've seen these other stores, let me know down in the comment section. I'm assuming the, the dollar stores as well. Now, what's interesting is that it says on the bottom here, six jumbo warhead. I don't know if that's the equivalent of how sour it is or that's, you know, what is in the brine maybe. I don't know, but it's pickle in the bag. You can see it's got all the, the liquid, the brine. And that's it. It's a pickle with sour, sour juice. So let's break into this and see what it's all about. I like warheads. I don't eat them often. It was kind of a thing of the past, but hey, if I come across a warhead, I'll certainly eat it. <clears throat> Whoop. I ripped both ways. Now I have a carry handle. Isn't that nice? That's <laughs> not what I meant to do, though. Uh, this is why we carry knives, don't we? And look at that convenience right on my neck. As long as I don't fall on, I'll be fine. All right, so let's uh, nip this other side because that's kind of annoying looking. Let me get into this. All right, so. I mean, it smells like a pickle. Put her knife away. Um, maybe I'll try the brine first. Should I bite it first or try the brine? Let's try the juice, the brine inside. I mean, it's a pickle. I'll show you in a second. <laughs> All right, but the smell, you can smell... Not that sour has a scent, but it definitely smells sour. Maybe that's suggestive because I know it's sour. Anyway, cheers. Let's try some Warhead Brine. <laughs> it's pretty sour. Although, not as sour as a Warhead. Mostly pickle flavor. It's not like there's a specific um, Warhead flavor in here. It's just like the... You know, the sour stuff, which off the top of my head, I'm escaping. It's escaping me what's actually making it sour. It's in the, um, looking in the ingredients. Nope. I don't think so. I forget what that is on candy. The white powder that goes on candy makes it super sour. I know a million of you are going to comment, so thank you for that. All right, let's try a little, another sip here. Yeah, it's sour. All right, here is the pickle. It's a big pickle. You get your money's worth. Shake off that juice. I don't want to drip it anywhere. Let's give this a big, healthy bite. You ready? Hopefully this doesn't juice everywhere. Three, two, one. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, I got an itch in my nose. There we go. Oh, God. Well, you always get itchy when you can't, like, itch yourself. All right. It was fine for a while, then all of a sudden it started dripping out of nowhere. That is really good. I'm going to take another bite, and I'm going to describe to you my experience. A lot of chewing going on. All right, so first of all, that's really good. That's tasty. I like pickle stuff. I'm surprised I didn't see these at the, um, I went to the whole pickle festival, the Big Dill in um, Baltimore. <laughs> I almost forgot. I would think I would have saw that there. I, I saw everything pickle in the world. It, it was a million products, but anyway. So... What I'm surprised by is that it's really good and it is sour, but it's not nearly as sour as I thought it would be. I thought it would be like like face puckering, suck the moisture out of your head, sour. And it's not. It's actually really enjoyable sour. I guess it depends on how sour you like it. I don't know. It, it says extreme. I don't think it's extreme. I think it's tasty as hell, though. What's weird is that I don't know why I thought that it would have like a Warhead flavor, because really Warhead's... 
the flavors are in the candy. Like, it's not blue raspberry extreme sour pickle. They should have done that. I really think instead of just a pickle with the sour, because you're selling the Warhead's name. And I know Warhead's, like, whores out their name. Like, they use their stuff on everything. There's, like, energy drinks and sodas and alcohol and, I mean, you name it. There's all kinds of um, Warhead stuff. But um, I think they definitely should have made it flavors, you know, like a green apple pickle and then use that flavoring in there. That would have been really interesting. Excuse me. Didn't mean to burp there. <laughs> it's involuntary. But, yeah, I mean, it's good. Let's see. Let's do the challenge. I'll eat the rest here on camera for you. Because I know you're thinking, that was not enough. I'd like to see Jeff eat more pickle. You may want to ask yourself why you're here. All right. Anyway, take another bite. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. There's, there's people walking over there. Nice couple. Taking a stroll on a chilly day. But, excuse me, shouldn't talk in your mouth full. Um, they were looking over here just kind of wondering why there's a dude filming himself eat a pickle. Alright, more brine. Oh. <laughs> the, brine, the brine's got a little kick because they normally have a kick anyway. It's brine, it's very, very salty, very strong flavored. Another bite of the pickle. Here goes. I feel like I need something to go with this. The pickle's good, but it'd be even better with like a hoagie. You know, big old sub. <clears throat> By the way, what do you call it? I grew up in Jersey, so it was always a hoagie. Italian hoagie, right? Um, I've heard everything from, I mean, I'm in Pennsylvania. I feel like Pennsylvania people call it grinders. Maybe that's somewhere else. I forget the whole debate. Grinder, hoagie, hero. We use hero a lot too in Jersey too. So it's kind of a mix, I guess, between um, hoagie and, and hero. Uh, sub sandwich, that's another one, submarine sandwich, because it's shaped like a submarine. There's a lot of ways to describe that thing, isn't there? All right, going in. But uh, anyway. That's when I enjoy pickles the most, is with something, you know, like a Reuben sandwich and a couple of really nice homemade pickle chips. I don't generally eat pickles by themselves. I love pickles, but again, it's a, a almost like a condiment. It's something extra. All right, there's still a bunch of brine left in here. A lot of juice. Juice. All right, let's, um, let's chug this and then down the last piece here. Oh. So there's the sour pickle challenge. Finish the whole thing. Uh, it was good. I feel like I might pay for that later, though. All that salt and acidity in my stomach. <laughs> anyway, that's all. I hope you got everything out of this video you were hoping to. It's me. Eat a pickle. Uh, a big mouthful of the brine was definitely like a... It was a punch of sour. It was, it was certainly sour. Overall, though, a little bit disappointing. Because I feel like it, it should have been... It should have been like almost unedible. Maybe that sounds stupid because people are buying these to eat them, but I feel like there's a huge novelty here. If, you, if you're if you buying a bagged pickle at like Walmart all the time or a place like that, maybe this is just a nice different flavor. But for most people, it's probably some kind of a, you know, gimmicky thing you'd get your friend or something or a gift and, um, you know, just to try out and probably make a lot of faces and have fun.
But anyway, I thought it was pretty good. So there you go. Thank you, Corey. Thanks for letting me know what's up. Um, I enjoyed it. Thought it was nice. So there you go. If you guys have a YouTube channel, feel free to make the, uh, the Warhead Pickle Challenge video. Um, maybe it'll be just as boring as mine. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what you guys expected. But yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.